But young Australians, uh, I think most of them have had sort of two, three, maybe four vaccines, and we're still waiting to see really, look for the evidence of whether we need an annual COVID vaccine. Hey, hello. Hi. Uh, super jab, which combines the COVID and flu vaccines into a single dose. <laughs> it's just science, eh? <laughs> Mind-blowing, isn't it? Vaccine giant Moderna says the shot could be available in 2026 to discuss. Let's bring in today medical expert Dr Nick Coatesworth in Canberra. Doc. Good morning, Doc. Are you on board morning, with this uh, super jab? I'm, I'm on board with the technology. I mean, I think it's great that we're having multiple doses of, of vaccine in a single in a single needle. You don't want to have multiple needles if you don't don't need to. No, they're completely different viruses. That's the problem. Is we're just going to need so many vaccines. I, I guess we've got plenty of time if it's not coming out till 2026 to prove that we actually need another COVID jab on a year-on-year -year basis. I think one of the problems with COVID-19 was that we didn't have the extent of the trials in the kids' population before we said the vaccine could be rolled out. And of course, there were a number of countries that didn't roll out COVID-19 vaccine, I think with some justification in their child population. Of course, adults over 65 do, mm. but young Australians, uh, I think most of them have had sort of two, three, maybe four vaccines. And we're still waiting to see really, look for the evidence of whether we need an annual COVID vaccine. I think you know what I'm going to say. <laughs> the other thing that I'm concerned about is um, that if I have another um, dose, um, that I may get complications. Um, I've, I've seen all this, um, all these reports on the internet about fit and healthy people just dropping down with heart issues, uh, and it's still not obviously established yet whether or not the vaccine caused some of these heart issues. But that's a worry for me more so than getting COVID. <laughs> Well, that's what why car? I said all that, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> For your know. benefit entirely. I don't know. Look, uh, we had enough trouble with the one vaccine. Now you've, you're putting all sorts of things into it and, and you're expecting us to lap it up. Um, what if I get sick from a colleague here that's unvaccinated, even though I'm vaccinated? Do you only have to have one? What? Well, I'm not sure. I'm not sure we had, we had the degree of trouble that, that you're referencing there, Carl. Ginny, just how common are these cardiac arrests on the footy field? But I think that, you know, the purpose is to have multiple, multiple doses of different viruses Understood. in one vaccine so you don't have to have more than one needle. No, they're completely different viruses. That's the problem is we're just going to need so many vaccines.